Do you know how to create new directories in Linux? Well, you do that with the make directory command. So as an example here, if I type ls, you can see some directories. But if I type make directory level one, that allows me to create a new directory. So typing that command again, ls-l, you can see on the left-hand side here that it indicates that this is a directory and I could use the cd command to move into that directory. Notice how my prompt changed from that to this. So pwd shows me that I'm there. If I go back a directory, pwd shows me that I'm here. So I'm in my home directory, whereas previously when I moved to the level one directory, I was in level one in my home directory. Now I could create a bunch of directories by using this command, make directory, and let's just say test one, test two, test three. So ls-l now shows me that I have those three directories created. I could remove those directories by using the remove directory command, and I'll just say test with a star here, which will remove those three directories because they start with test followed by something. So star says delete everything after the word test and notice those are gone. If I go into level one, I could make a new directory here. So a subdirectory called level two and then move into that directory and make another directory called level three. So I'll use CD to go back to my home directory. So notice I'm back at home David. And if I use the tree command, you'll see that this is a subdirectory of that, which is a subdirectory of level one. Now I will not be able to remove level one because it has other directories or files in it. So we told that we can't remove it because the directory is not empty, but I could use rm-r level one to remove recursively that directory and all subdirectories. So if I type ls-l now, notice level one and the subdirectories are gone. So we don't see level one. And if I type tree again, notice level one, two and three are gone. You need to be careful with Linux because you have a lot of power and with great power comes great responsibility. Notice it's not like Windows trying to ask you, do you really, really wanna do this? It just does what you tell it to do. Now as always in Linux, use dash dash help to get help information about a command. So make directory help. This allows us to create directories if they don't exist. And we can specify various options here. Man or manual pages allows us to read about a command. So make directory. You can see that this is the make directories command. You can see various options here about that command. Not much for this specific command, but man pages are really useful. So if I use the command man ls, I can see a lot of options for the list directory contents command. Do you have any tips and tricks with regards to this command or other Linux commands?